on everybody this is al from playbookgamer.com and this may come as a surprise but i decided to sneak in a NCAA football 09 exhibition game now a few weeks ago i posted an overview of 09 and had some general good thoughts but things have changed since then and i never followed up on that and i want to talk a little bit about that today Let's go over to settings. This way, this thing goes to go to an automatic game. Um, okay. NCAA 07. The problem I have with it is the momentum meter and the big hits results in just bad plays for both teams. I just can't get over that. That's just too much of an issue for me. So, that's enough for me to not have to play 07. 08 has the terrible pursuit angle issue. I could cover that one day, but anybody who's played 08 knows what I'm talking about with that. With 09, that's basically been fixed. Now, the problem with 09 that I've seen so far, the big one, is in Dynasty mode, there, after like the second or third season, there are a lot of teams put on probation due to just not discipline their kids enough. There's a discipline issue, basically, in this game. I'm trying to find a way to get over that. The only way I can think of is how many dynasties do you play where you go more than two or three seasons? Sometimes for me, I barely go two or three, and I'm ready to move on to something else. So I'm willing to halfway look past that. Plus, a lot of the teams that get put on probation, the first uh, misdemeanor, if you will, that they have, the first punishment, is they get 10 scholarships taken off. Well, that's not a big deal in these games because these teams only have 70 players on the roster. And when you recruit 25 kids every year, that's too many kids anyways. So now they're only forced to get 15 kids. And 15 every year is more than enough for a couple of years until their punishment is done with. So I'm not too upset over that. But I'm afraid to know what it looks like five years into a dynasty, how many teams are put on probation. In the description box, I have a link to a little study that I did. I wrote about it on Operation Sports forums where it talks about the probation issue. You can check that out at your leisure. But again, I think I'm willing to sort of look past that. Now with 09, what I want to focus on today is, is the momentum meter and the big hits, are they toned down? Are the fumbles toned down? If they are, then... I'm willing to give 09 a shot because 09 has some amazing cool stuff in it. Playbooks, don't get me started. There's too much cool stuff to look at. So I, I'm, I'm really trying my hardest to make some of these games work, and I want to make 09 work. I'd like to think, as you can see here, for example, we're going to go five minutes in this exhibition game. You go down here, the return camera, you can turn that off, which is cool. Stuff like that. But again, the playbooks are amazing. They got the auto motion stuff, and we'll show some of that in the exhibition game. I'm not going to play 10 or 11. They're exact same game, and they have some really severe dynasty issues. The biggest problem is the recruiting. Like 80% of the five-star kids are quarterbacks or wide receivers. I don't know why they've done that. That's just stupid, and I just that was enough for me to not care. Plus, I had some bad issues with 10 in the past, and I just didn't want to bother with it. So I'm going to give 09 a chance. We're going to at least go one exhibition game, but if we see a ton of big hits and a couple of fumbles, then I'm just going to give up on it, but I have to see it for myself first. So that's what we're going to do today. Let's go to the settings real quick. As of right now, I'm just going to have everything set at default 50 for the offense, except uh, on defense, we're going to get break block down to 10 for both sides, only because jump the snap. We're going to try to negate it if we can. I may have to put it down to zero. I'm willing to kind of look past that. I looked past it in 07. I'm willing to look past it in 09. Oddly enough, jump to snap was not the biggest problem with 07 for me. It was the momentum meter, the big hits, and it caused all kinds of stupidness. Stupidity, let's put it that way. Uh, everything else, I'm just going to set at 50, like special teams. I'm not worried about that. Again, I'm focusing on momentum meter, fumbles, big hits. Has that been toned down today? So let's just get right into it. Let's just go ahead and save this. Uh, there's another really cool thing in 09 that I love. I wish it was like an 06. I'll show that to you today if I can. Let's just get right into our exhibition game. 
we are going to be Tennessee. That's what I always like to start that first exhibition game whenever I do these, uh, play these games. We're going to be in Tennessee, and we are going to take on a, a balanced team, the same team, or a team that's about to got the same amount of talent as we do. We're going to go up against, I think Arizona State has roughly the same talent. It looks pretty even. B-plus overall for both teams. Now, let's go select the stadium. Let's make sure the, the weather's good enough. Let's just do that. They run a 3-3-5. I want to try to at least make this. I'm not... Let's just do that. And we'll go up against... A, I know their defense is going to look weird, but I don't... I just want to see the momentum. I don't care, you know... Why do they have us on a 3-3-5? I don't want to run a 3-3-5. I'm going to run a... We never ran a 3-3-5 back in the day. I don't know why they've done that. Offensive playbook? Yes, I just... We'll be Tennessee. We'll use Tennessee's playbook. they got enough variety in it. Okay, let's go ahead and get this started. Again, cross your fingers. I'm really hoping I don't see too many goofiness in this game. I don't want to see 1,800 big hits, eight fumbles. I just don't want to see any of that. I'm willing to look past the probation issue, and it's quite possible there's other big issues in this game. I don't know yet. But I want to give it a chance because, again, they got so many cool things in this. The playbooks, the other feature I'm referencing to, we'll talk about it here in a minute. Hi, everybody. Brad Nessler along with my partners, Kirk Herbstreet and Lee Corso. It's a sweltering late summer game today here between the Tennessee Volunteers and the Arizona State Sun Devil. A little bit different. And we're set to bring you another intro great matchup preview. in the world of NCAA football. And here come the Sun Devils. Fans on both sides think their team is going to win this thing. What's your prediction, Kirk? Arizona State needs a big game from their talented running back, and I think they'll win the battle up front, and he's going to have a tremendous day. Look for him to lead them to victory, but Lee, it's going to be very close. There's no question who I'm buying in this one. I've got to go with it. All right, they're going there's a State. That's fine. I don't really care. Let's go here. Right, let's get the ball first. Okay, let's go to our roster. That's another thing with 09, you could do Super Sim if you just want to play offense, defense, however you wish. That's a neat little feature. Okay, we can look at our roster really quick. I just need to see what I have. This was 09, so this was the 08 season. That was a bad year for us. This was Phil Formers last year. Arian Foster, impact guy. We're going to give it to him some today. Lucas Taylor, just kind of looking. I did auto shuffle the the depth chart for everybody. That way it kind of came out a little bit better. Sometimes the, the guys who create these roster files don't take it to account. They just forget to auto adjust the depth chart for everybody. So now it's a little bit better. Uh, once you just it's a, it takes you ten minutes to auto adjust, auto reorder every roster in the game. We got pretty much pretty good talent across the board even though we failed miserably that year. Okay, let's just go to theirs, and let me just see what they have. They got an impact quarterback, impact running back. Again, I'm not too worried about schematics of things today. Again, for the 18th time, I just want to focus on, is the goofiness toned down in some form or fashion? A la big hits, momentum meter, leading the fumbles, stuff like that. I just can't stand. Okay, that's I didn't need to see the rest of that. All right. We can show you, uh, let's just go ahead and play the game. Okay, there's no return Arizona camera. Is lined up to I'm going to turn that down. It sounds so loud. Jeez. Let's go to settings, audio. Oh, no wonder. Play-by-play -play is up way too. There we go. Let's do that. Okay. Yeah, you can turn the return camera off. That's nice. Kicks off. That's a little bit better. Let's go up the middle of the field. Maybe we can do something Taylor with them. Takes from the 10. Oh, the wow. Party. Big hit, first so play. We'll get dang it, dang it, dang it. All right. First drive of this game. Look at that. Great up the middle. I love the look of that. But a big hit, first play. Okay. Let's do some cool things. Let's go. Like, here's some auto motion stuff, like this counter trap, halfback slam. Let's try this slam. They'll start at the 38. We're going man. 
I wonder if you can... Foster, the lone back. Oh, it, it takes out the auto motion when you do that. Inside you. He's tackled. If you 41. flip to the other Three direction of the run, run it goes the other way. It, it takes away the auto motion. So, for example, like here's counter trap going to the right. If I uh, wanted to go to the left, the auto motion would go away. At least for that last play, it did. Let's try for this Foster one. Lines up as a single back. Foster, the ball carrier. Brought down at the All right, it's third and whatever. Pick uh, up third and six. We'll tailback. pick just something. Let's get in the gun. Again, they added a bunch of cool stuff to the playbooks. If I could find something worth calling. Uh, I need to pick something quick. Let's do curl flat. That's fine. Hopefully this shows so us. All right, it's zone. I'm curious to see what's going to happen here. It's third down and six to go. Of course, I'm not even in the middle of the field. The ball come out showing three wide. He's looking. Got hit as he threw. Yeah, I got hit as soon as, as I threw it. Senior. And that's three and I couldn't tell. Was that a big hit as well? You All right, either way. On the back. We'll punt it. It didn't they show what I was going to show you. Hopefully range. I'll be able to show that off today. That little feature. Booming kick. Somebody got a great jump. Aaron takes it to the 12. Sheds that one. Now we'll get to see how this quarterback can do today. As They're going five out the wide out of the, the gates. It could be a long day for this left tackle as he takes on the challenge of blocking this animal at defensive end. We're going to have the opportunity to see a guy who can really create problems by getting to the quarterback. And something tells me he's going to be getting to that quarterback a lot today. He's not exactly going against the best left tackle in the history tackle of Tackle there, good play by Rico McCoy. Got to get before he even got started on that thing. That defense had their eyes on that kid the entire time. Man, that still sounds really loud. I'm so sorry, but it sounds super loud to me. You guys be, might be able to hear me perfectly, but I tone that down just a little bit more. Whew. It's only so much lead course so I can stand. Arizona State goes with the ace. That's a little bit here. better. Eric Berry, I forgot he was in this game. That's a good tackle there. Not much for the runner as he gets and back to the line of scrimmage. I'm sure they didn't put back my cover three clay out. I wish they did. I'm not seeing it. Let's go with a basic cover three. They took it out for whatever reason. Maybe they thought it was too good. I don't know. Third down. The D-line shifts over. Big dog, big dog. Oops. Carpenter drops back to pass. Oh, I couldn't get to him in time. Oh, wow. He somehow caught that. That was weird. Off the back foot. Huh. Weird. All right. Good job up front by the offensive line, and don't forget the nice play by the running back as well. Let's do quarters. First down, ten yards to go. They got impact guys to the line with three wide. all in the backfield, so it's untailing what they want to call today. Motion, and it's a good play right there. Just good run. Let's go with the cover one. Let's go crash gold. When you break one like that, you got to give a lot of credit to the offensive line. The Devils line up with a single setback here. Good tackle there. All right, second down and seven. three yards on the carry. Let's go back to quarters, I guess. The second down and seven to go. Ball in the 42. Arizona State goes with the ace set. At here. least I could do bump and run with my quarters in this game. I can't do that in 05. That disappointed me a little bit. Somebody got to him. A sack. I didn't really pay attention. So now it's third and 11. We can try cover three again. So another third down upcoming for the offense. Nickel defense. And I complete that. Dang it, I hit the wrong button. That's why he caught the <laughs> That was my bad. I forgot the speed button is the same for both sides. My bad, my bad. Uh, let's go to a zone blitz. It's fine. 
First and ten. Again, I'm not too worried about the outcome today. It's not that big of a deal to me yet. Oh, he dropped it. Wide open, though. Great play, though. Let's do another cover one. It's second down and ten to go. And this is the ninth play of the current drive. 391. Somebody jumped early. Got a false start by the left tackle. He got confused on the snap count. Yeah, but that just uh, second is Let's do another zone blitz. That's fine. Second and fifteen. We had some good talent on that team that year, and we just bungled it to no end. It's a good tackle there. All right, I'm not seeing a whole lot of big hits. That's a positive. Now, I'm going to do quarters instead of cover three. They've been two for two on third downs in this drive, and they'll try to convert again here. Now, I got a whole lot of ground to cover over here. Touchdown. Oh, nope. Adam. Threw it too hard. All right. They're going to kick a field goal. They're going to do a field goal safe, man. I didn't see a whole lot of big hits right there. That's a positive. That gives me a little bit of hope. He makes the extra the field goal. All right, let's get back on offense and just do something. I'm hoping I'm, I may throw a little bit more than usual because I wanted to show you, like, the coolest thing I like about 09. I think that's when it, they added it. I may have to run a lot of curl flat to make it work, but let's see. Oh, look at that. Look at those holes. That's another big hit, but at least he didn't fumble. Okay, let's go here and let's do a wide receiver run play here. This is awesome that they added this. They're going man, too. The volunteer come out of the ace formation. Good little play there. Quentin Hancock. A little auto motion there. Okay, let's do a curl flat. Let's see if I can pull this off. They're going man. It only works well against zone. I assume the curl's a good man beater. Ooh, he's... Ooh. I thought he was going to pick that off there. All right, let's keep throwing. I'm going to see if I can make this work. Forgive me if I'm going to run up like curl flat's the easiest way to show this. Curl flat's not in the one. Wow, they got some cool stuff. Let's do flanker curl. All right, they're going zone. Maybe this will work. I'm not going to pay attention to my center beater. No, nope, we're going to have to go. Good little play there. I don't think it worked. Okay, here's what I was going to show you. It'll show a, whole, a lot better. Sometimes, you know, in the previous games, against zone, the corner will always go back, which means you always have your underneath route as your zone beater, which is like the flat in the curl flat. But, oh, now they changed up. Now you have to read the corner. Sometimes he'll go up. Sometimes he'll go down, which is amazing. You actually have to read a defender. So you can do a lot of high-low reads. And there's a ton of combos in this game. So hopefully I can show that to you. No, I didn't mean to do that. I accidentally pressed the... <laughs> that's fine. Let's just go with it. Picking up the five yards. <laughs> I accidentally pressed the hurry up button. What else do I have here? There was another wide receiver sweep. Well, let's do this curl flat. Yeah, they're going man. Eventually they'll go zone and they'll show they'll do that. I hope the out route still works in this game. They're bringing off the back foot. Fixing to get sacked. Now it's what, third down? Third and six. Again, forgive me, but I just wanted to show that off to you. Uh, you can do that with a double smash, but I want to wait. Let's do another curl flat. All right, they're going zone. I hope that corner Brink comes up. He may not do it. It just depends on what zone play they call. There we go. That's what I wanted to show you. Six points. All right. Let's talk about this. Now, they went zone. Again, most of the time the corner is supposed to come up. He always goes up leaving your short zone flat, defend, or flat uh, route open. 
But look what the corner does here. He takes the flat read instead. That's awesome. You finally have to read a corner. It's really cool. And that was a little bit of a bad angle. That's not as bad as 08, trust me. All right. We'll kick an extra point. Here's the try for the extra point. By the time I caught the ball, he was already... He was going for where I stopped, not where I was going. So that didn't look like that bad to me compared to what I've seen in 08. All right. I'm glad I at least I got to show you that part. Now we can do some other things. We can do other... I don't have to call Curl Flat anymore. Tennessee. Little drive summer. That's pretty cool. So I think it's really cool. I've been able to run up the middle on the kickoffs. You can't do that in 06. For whatever reason, you just can't. And my kicker, or he's actually my punter, got the tackle. Let's do another zone blitz while we're here. They'll go to work at the 25. Don't run up the middle. Good tackle there. Good stop there. So I'm not seeing as many big hits, and we're not seeing any fumbles, which is, again, that was just a deal breaker for me in 07. Oop, I don't know what they're doing here. Ooh, counter trap. It's a good stop there. All right, it's third and forever. We can try that cover three again. I can control a defensive end. The linebacker shift over a little. Carpenter drops back. He's looking. Throws it. There's a big hit. Great play. Caused the drop. Again, at least we're not seeing fumbles yet. <laughs> we may see eight in the second half. You never know. All right, let's get back on offense and do some different things. I don't know my playbook all that well. That's a good stiff arm. Lucas Taylor is a good ball player for us. Let's go twins and see what we have. I wonder if the counter play still works in this game. It worked fairly well in 07. That was one of the positives of, I liked with 07. They got everybody their brother on that side. Not a whole lot there, which is good defense. Let's stay here and see what we have. Let's run this slants play. We're going man. I don't know if the slants work all that well in this game, so I may just go to stalker since we are going up against man. That's good defense. He got a hand on it. Good play, good play. Uh, I wonder if deep comeback. Let's try this. All right, they're going man. Okay, everybody, their brothers coming up. Ooh, that was a bad play. That play threw me off. That's a weird defense. They went back or something. They brought both safeties. I should have went to my comeback route. That's my fault. Oh, don't mess up on me. Oh, that's right. You can save your photos. If you held down L3, it'll do that. All right, that was my bad. Uh, let's just go for it. I don't care. Again, I don't really care about the score today. Let's try if I can find something. I don't want to do another curl. Let's do slot post. All right, we're going man. And the offense is still on the field. And up in the shotgun. Looks to pass. I got hit as soon as I threw it. I guess it was a bad jump. Left tackle got destroyed. It just jump the snap. It is what it is in these games. I even done a false snap and all that good stuff, and it didn't help. All right, they got the ball back. Not a big deal. Let's just go here. Again, I really don't care about the outcome of the game. Just want to see a good, clean game. Oh, that was a quick draw. Did you see that? Wow, look at how quick that draw was. That's not like 05. Look at this. That was quick. Was that a... Yeah, that was a half... That was a draw. I'm going to start using draw now if, that's a, if it's that quick. Hmm. 
I wasn't expecting that. All right, let's go to a one high. From the 23 yard line, first down. One man backfield. Eric Berry. Best safety I ever saw at Tennessee. Oh, and he dropped it. Number 13 was the intended receiver. It was there. It was a good throw. I was trying another just zone blitz. That's fine. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 23 yard line. I thought they was going three wide. I wasn't expecting that. Herring, the lone back. I may not blitz. I'll just control the blitzer. Play action. Ooh. Rolls to the left. Good play right there. The that's the first down. He was able to make that oh, it's third and one. I think that's one of the toughest catches. Able to focus on the ball and Let's the just go with a pinch line. blitz. Let's go with an all out and just see what happens. Come to the line with their jumbo package. Oh, good hit. Big hit. At least he didn't fumble it. And let me tell you, the key to that play was right there in the defensive line. All right. They tied this offensive line. Again, we're on Heisman, too, which actually I'm surprised that things are going the way they are. But again, you never know with these games. Credit the big guys up front for that play. The kick is up, and it is good. All right, let's get back on offense and try some things. Let's give our, our best halfback the ball. Arian Foster. Arizona State lines up for the kickoff. Sends it sailing downfield. Nick Reves, his dad was an amazing kicker Taylor. for us back in the day. Uh, let's do a power O. This is basic power play. I don't know if it works well or not in this game. But this is common stuff in football now, just pulling guards without the counter look. Let's do that. Hey, this may go as a touchdown. I don't know if that was an angle. No. Okay, that gives me hope. Woo! We can look at this. I thought it was going to be a bad angle issue. That safety came into blitz. That's why he done that. Thankfully, that guy back there, that's why the angle issue was fixed in 09. 08, I don't know what that guy would have done, but he made a perfect angle and saved the touchdown. Oh, I'm glad that I saw that. Okay, we got some other things. I don't know if any of this will work. Let's do flanker drive. We're going man. I got several options. I wonder if the shallow route will work. And it will. Oh, bad throw. He was wide open, too. So went with the one high, but look how open my shallow was. <laughs> mm. All right, let's stay here. There's counter. I'm pretty sure toss doesn't work. Interesting option look. Let's try that. Option weak. It's got an auto motion in it. So it's second and ten. The volunteers. Ooh, everybody, their brother's coming. <laughs> this may be a busted play. We'll see. I gotta get this off quick. Ooh, oh no. Just a bad pitch. Gosh, that was bad. Oh, it took a bad angle. That's just a bad play all around. Very fortunate we got the ball back. All right, third and five. They are very, very fortunate to get that. Let's do a curl flat again. Let's try it. We're going zone. I want to see that corner come up. They line up at the 24. Third and five situation. The offense lines up with three wide receivers. Nope, we're gonna have to go to the flat. Complete. More. Pick up the first down. Again, the corner decided to stay up this time. If I can put my cursor on him. There we go. He went, he stayed up, leaving my flat open. So that is amazing. You don't know how much of a big deal that is for me that I can actually read defenders now. I don't have to always say, all right, it's zone, we got to go to the flat. Now you have to kind of make up your mind a little bit and decide based off what that defender is doing. Uh, let's try another power. Oh, we'll do it from I normal this time. They're going man. They're going nickel. They're doing that. Let's go to the weak side. Good little play there. Pick up five. They'll probably go goal line. I wonder if this formation works on goal line again. We can try. Let's go blast. Nope, they fixed it. In 06, they never go goal line on this formation. The ball 
I may try to draw him off sides here. We may go to the goal line itself. I'm going to call a timeout. Let's just call a timeout. Half is about over with. Offense, O line, that's fine. Goal line. Oh, we can try. Toss weak. I think it'll only let me go to the left, though. We can go ahead and try. We can leave it as is. That's just good play, good defense. All right, we can stay here and go line and try. PA boot slide. We're going zone. I don't know what's best to go here. We'll try something. And that was a busted play. Dang it, dang it, dang it. <laughs> That's a busted play. Did you see that? Er, er, er. Well, we know that play doesn't work. <laughs> I couldn't even throw it away. That's hilarious. All right, let's kick a field goal. This one should be makeable. This will be about a 29-yard field goal attempt. Daniel Lincoln, pretty good kicker back in the day. We can try some play action on the next drive. Good kick. Oh, at least the trajectory is a little bit higher than it is in 07. 07, every kick was like really, really low. That one seemed a tad bit higher. Of course, you could crank it up if you need to. You could go higher or low on them. Old Dustin Colquitt, all American. Still playing for the Chiefs, I think. Get him. Flag? No, that's just showing possession. Okay. I don't know what they're going to call. 28 seconds, they may just run it out the clock. Man, I don't like the way he done that. Now let's go back and see what happens. Oh, they're going to throw it. Oh, big play right here. Oh, just overthrew it. Well, at least they're attacking my quarters deep. You rarely see that. Let's just stay with quarters again. That's fine. So it's second and ten. The devil are lining up with three receivers. I don't like that. That's fine. We'll stick with that. Big hit, but he didn't fumble it. I'm not going to stop the clock. There's no point. These guys stayed in their lanes and made a very nice play. I love doing that defensive shift. It just makes your defensive fronts look weird, really weird. Your front yeah, sevens at least. All right, end of the half. Let's look at some stats. Not much offensively between the teams. I'm not worried about that yet. We can try to fix that down the road. Again, I'm only playing on five-minute quarters. Uh, passing has been okay. Not too worried about that. Here's the big thing, though. There's only been one fumble. What was the fumble? I don't remember what the fumble was. Oh, that's when I pitched it. That was my pitch. So we haven't seen any true fumbles today. That was the big thing for me. Now, I wish it tracked big hits, but I'm not seeing as many. So this is a big positive for me. Now, in the next exhibition game, we may see eight of them. I'm not sure. But I'm very happy and pleased to see that right there. That's what I was looking for. So let's just get into the third quarter. Second half just about set to get underway as the teams line up for the kick. Hey, okay, that's good to know. Decent I was kick. pressing the X button ready to do the 06 kicking. <laughs> Herring, Go, Colquitt, get him. Uh-oh, no stop him. So before the offense hits okay. The field, let's take the time to let you know. Uh, let's do a fire to see what happens with it. Lines Please up don't run to the left. No. Ooh, got, we got to him. They got new down. tackle animations. I don't know if you've noticed that. I'm seeing a couple different ones. It's second down and eight to go. Red 
three wide out here. Ooh, big play right there. Wow, well, wasn't expecting that. That was weird. Got the first down. Let's do a one high. I don't know what to make of the over and under front stuff. I feel like I don't have to use it because I can kind of make my own in the regular 4-3 stack. Oh, big catch. I didn't pay it. I'm going to go back and look at that catch. I, I thought he jumped up for it. It's a good play there. Okay. They're moving the ball on us pretty well. Let's go back to his own blitz. First down, 10 yards to go. Arizona State goes with the ace set here. Rico McCoy. Get him. Nothing there. Second and seven. Let's just do quarter. Ooh, they got Tampa two, which is interesting. What's the difference between that and the regulars uh, cover two? It doesn't look any different. Maybe the middle linebacker goes back really far. By design. I'll have to try that later. Ooh, got to bring my guys up. Nothing there. Third and six. We can attempt cover three again. Third and six. Ball on the 46 yard line. The devil come out showing three wide. Uh, couldn't get to him in time. Oh, look at this play right here. Ooh. What a throw. Did you see that quarterback? Go back and look at the throw here. He throws ahead of him. Oh, wow. What a throw that was. He threw it four while he was leaning in. That's pretty wild. Fourth and six. Let's do a middle fan. Those safe returns I'm not a big fan of. We'll try this one. Hopefully nothing weird happens. Besides, I'd rather have a wide receiver catch this than a safety. He punts this one high we'll fair catch that. Get out of catch. the way. Oh, no. Don't touch it. Don't touch it. Yeah. Oh, good. They do that. You see that. That's the first time I've ever seen them do that. I don't know if that was introduced in this game. It could have been the other games as well. But look, everybody back up. That's awesome. That's awesome that they do that. You can't do that in 06. All right, first to 10. What else do we have in this? Oh, oh let's try that draw play. Let's do it, yeah. Let's do it from here. First down, we'll spread them out if we can. Ball on the nine yard line. That's a little quicker. Not a whole lot. Second and eight. Sub packages. I gotta have my sub packages. They don't have these in 05. Let's do 46 wide cross. That looked pretty Second funky. They're going man. That's a really shallow. Let's go here. He can't hear that, can he? Nope, he can't hear it. Let's get back there. Come on. Good play there. Still third and what? Third and two? Can I run? Let's do a basic toss. Third down and two to go. Ball on the 17. Good play there. Good play. Now, this may go for a touchdown. I don't know. I can't tell. If, I think the safeties were blitzing. We can look at this. I think they were blitzing. Yeah, both safeties came in, so that was a... Yeah. I had no chance on that one. I don't know what this guy was doing here. You'll see some of this in 08. It's not as bad as in 09. But I know this guy right here... I guess he just, I don't know what he was thinking. He had no chance of getting to me anyways. But the reason we scored a touchdown there, of course, the blocking was good. But obviously, the safeties came in and blitzed. So that's just a perfect combination to go to score a touchdown right there. Okay. Good play. All right, let's kick an extra point. Blitz 
the uprights with the extra point. I'm going to try. I'm really hoping I can make 0-9 work in terms of the momentum meter, big hits, fumbles. Hopefully we don't, we don't see as much of that. And I'm willing to try to get past the probation thing because, again, by the time you get in season three, a lot of times you're ready to move on to something else. So unless you want to go with the 12 season dynasty, then that may be kind of interesting. <laughs> See if everybody's on probation. I need to test that. I want to. I'm curious to see what what will happen with that. Arizona State comes to the line. Only one man in the backfield. Halfback draw. They're determined to give to their halfback today. It's not working though. One yard loss for the halfback. Area Foster's already got 144 yards. Of course, over half of that came from that last play. Let's go with another zone blitz. They haven't really been working today. We've got a second and 11. Ball on the 22 yard line. The Devil come out in the shotgun. Nope, can't get to him. Just a bad throw. I can see maybe QB accuracy going up. No, he's 6 for 13. He's just, and we're only 7 for 12. I'm not ready to make a judgment call on that one yet. Right, let's do another cover 3 for a third down. Linebackers move over. Carpenter, back to throw. Steps up, looking. Carpenter delivers. Oh, good play. I probably shouldn't have done that. That's just a good catch by the receiver. I tried to go for it myself. It was a good try. Probably should have let the CPU handle it. Let's do another cover one. It's first and ten. Ball on the 43. Arizona State goes with the ace set here. Cat two. Ooh, wasn't expecting that. I've... Mm. We got to him, though. Those auto motions could really mess up my underfronts. I can see that being an issue down the road. In a positive way, if that makes sense. Because they got some auto motion where they will go to the opposite side. Alright, pick up about five yards there. And it's what, third and five? Let's just do another quarters. Ooh, not a big fan of that look. Let's bring those guys back over. Oh, good catch. He didn't get the first, though. I thought he dropped it. I think he bobbled it. It probably will go for this. No, we're going to punt from the own 34. That makes plenty of sense. <laughs> they got those reverse plays in the punt return. I've never tried one. Interesting play call here. That's going in the end zone. I don't. They may not have a good kicker. I don't know. All right, middle of the field. Let's go here and now this ace bunch regular is a new formation. Technically, you got your fullback as a wing, then you got a tight end. Oh, you got oh, it's a bunch of big guys on the right side. Interesting. Huh? Hancock, Stalker. Yeah, that's a 21 personnel look. That's cool. That's a big hit, but he didn't fumble. <laughs> Still saying big hits, but we're not saying 800 fumbles. All right, end of the third quarter. We're up 11. Uh, let's try this counter trap. I want to try a little auto motion. We're going man. We may have a chance here if the blocking's good. I like where everybody's. Oh, no, 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 no. Get a block right there. Dang it. That's good defense. Couldn't get a block on that guy. All right, I want to try third and 11. I want to try this play again. Deep comeback, this time from I-Twins. They're going man. I was hoping they'd go zone. Ooh, maybe they are going zone. That deep comeback can usually work against zone. 
Nice, first down. It works right against man, obviously. Good play there. Now let's try some play action. Let's see what we have. This looks like a lot like the ace big twin tight end. Plays PA seam. There's Y stick, the legit Y stick from that looks awesome. If you want to run a little air raid from the pro style sets. PA tight end choice. Interesting. We got an auto motion on play action. We're going zone. I need to hurry up. And it's called timeout. I don't think I'm going to get that off in time. Let's go offense. Let's go offensive line. Let's try that again. We're going man. Looks like I have several options. This is going to be like, this is basically Spider 2 Y Banana. I'm going to try to give this to Cottom unless they bring both safeties. And they're bringing everybody. So we may be going over the top. And a sack. Just came on through. Everybody and their brother came blitzing, so. Let's do PA wide receiver in. They're going man. I got several options. And I couldn't get it off in time. What in the world? Oh, I pressed the wrong button. I pressed X. <laughs> X isn't a button for the receivers. I'm an idiot. That was my bad. We got anything deep here? Let's try to Z post or the slot post for going zone. This is the best of the game or play or drive, that's for sure. Oh, just interception. Yeah, that's just a good play. That was a bad play on my part. I keep hitting the wrong button. All right, that was just a bad drive all around. <laughs> That was a weird defensive play call. They brought the safeties, but they went with a cover three look with all the corners. That's interesting. And a linebacker. That threw me off. I didn't know what to do about that. I look, this guy was wide. Oh, I could have went to this guy right here. My bad. Interesting defensive look, though. I would like to do zone blitz, but it's not working a lot today. The defensive back's moving in closer. Ooh, ah. Uh-oh, ooh. That could have been a touchdown. He was close. All right, their quarterback's feeling it. Oh, they're doing a little no huddle. Interesting. Ooh, good play right there. And a face mask. That threw me off. I wasn't expecting that. I think everybody in the stadium saw that face mask. It's a face mask. It is what it is. Looks like he was holding on for dear life there, coach. He'll pay for it too. Fifteen yards, some lip from his coach. Ace backfield. They are going ace bunch or a version of it. Play action. Do a good play right there. Big play. They're fixing to score a touchdown on us. Boy, does this kid have an arm or what? Are you kidding me? It looks like he has a rocket launcher attached to his shoulder. Let's go with a bare front crash goal. I know it says they're going three wide, but they're inside the twenty. Let's see if they can take this one in for six. Oh wow! Look at that big play touchdown. They're gonna go for two. They're going with five wide. Let's do dime and bring everybody. If I can, let's do a fire green. So the offense will stay on the field and attempt the two-point conversion. Oops. Jumped early. I'm going to stay back. Bad throw. So what's the score? 17 to 12. Now, are they going to go? Okay, they're going to do a normal kick. I was fixing to say, it would be kind of weird if they went onside kick. There's too much time left. All right, another middle of the field run. I'm curious to see if we get a hole or two. No, that's good defense. But you see right here, though, this excites me. I'm not going to lie. I've had a lot of success running up the middle on kickoffs today. So it'd be cool to see a touchdown happen down the road. 
Let's run some more unique stuff. Let's run power again. Interesting, is that a 3-3-5 or a 3-3-2-6? Wow, that's just a busted play right there. The pulling, nobody pin. Oh, wow. This defensive end done a scrape. You rarely see that. He went inside. Wow, just an awesome play by him. Let's go. Strong H Twins. It's my number two tight end. That's right there. That's not a normal Twins. That's a 12 personnel look. Let's go back to that toss play. We'll continue to run the ball. We're going zone. I may have to run to the left. Oh, what a hit. He didn't fumble it, though. I should have used the hey, stiff arm a instead. Play, it's a good play there. His head might be still a bit. Yeah, I'm sure he felt that one. Let's do a curl flat. They We're going three zone. Three. We're going to try to go to somebody on the left, and we'll just see what that corner does. The volunteers are lining up with three receivers. If I can get the ball off in time. We'll run some clock. Good play. We can look at this again. The corner stayed up. He actually blitzed. That's what happened. Oh, went to the wrong guy. My bad. There he goes. Now he backs up. That's what I was. That's what I noticed. Now from this onset, you would think, hey, go to this guy, but you could tell those two guys were in front of him. So I made the right call. And went to the flat. That's awesome. You have to read defenders now on the outside. All right, first and ten. Let's just go offensive line. Uh, let's go back here, and let's run a wide receiver quick. Right. Now, I hope he doesn't fumble it. Wide receivers, you know, they're not really meant to run the ball. And it's going zone. This play might not work all that well against zone. And just a, yeah, jump the snap. Was that even was that even a jump to snap? No, he just came through. That wasn't even him. That's just bad blocking. Nobody picked him up. Now that's a jump to snap. That guy right there destroying my center or my left guard. Offensive line. Uh, oh, uh, we're gonna do counter again. Second down, 14 coming up here. We're going man. I'm going to force their timeouts. Ooh, you can't flip that. Okay, that's not a big deal. Not a bad little run, a little bit of a mini juke. All right, they're out of timeouts. It's third and seven. We probably need to throw to try to get the first. There's not enough time for me to run out the clock. Let's go back to that slot post. Where's it at? It's in this formation. There it is. Well, We're going man. Here are our players of the game. I didn't pay attention to who the player of the games were. The ball. Come out the shotgun. I'm going to try to go to my comeback route. Back back. Looks. Wants to throw outside. Touchdown. The Touchdown. I'm an idiot. First down. That should be game. Oh, that was the last time out right there. So we can run out the clock. That should be game over. Right. Know that they got one timeout left? I don't think it's going to matter. If they didn't have that one timeout, I got enough time to Tennessee run out. Alright, that was pretty fun. Biggest thing, I didn't see any goofy fumbles. I didn't see a whole lot of big hits. The momentum meter didn't really seem to affect all that nonsense. I'm pleased, I'm pleased, I'm pleased. Now, again, if I run another exhibition game, we may see the exact opposite. Lord, I hope not, but good to see a lot of positives today. So we'll look at some stats here.
17 to 12. It's an even matchup, so that's that score is pretty fine with. Now, again, I'm not too worried about the low stats. I'll, I'll just have to look here. Folks, yeah, I got Campus Challenge game. turned on. Okay, let's look at some stats. Oh, that's pretty cool. Use your report card. Apparently, I didn't do anything well today. Overall C, even though I beat a top 15 team. Okay. All right. Offensively, just wasn't a whole lot happened, but we had 251. That's still kind of low. But again, it's an even matchup, so maybe I'm overthinking that type of stuff. I'm not really sure. You know, again, I'm not worried about that yet because, again, we're doing five-minute quarters and such, and I've got everything pretty much set at default. We're at 50%. All right, we ran the ball pretty well, and our passing 10 for 16, I'm more than happy with every everything that looked good right there, I'm happy with. Passing, running, I'm thoroughly pleased. Their quarterback ended up doing a little bit better towards the end. Biggest thing, though, biggest thing. Boom, fumbles. We only had one, and that was because it was a bad pitch. We didn't see any big, stupid fumbles caused by big hits, none of that nonsense. Again, we may see that in the future. But not yet. Now, let's look at... We may find some bad things here. Let's go to... Receiving. I didn't see any drops. I guess there were... They had four drops. Maybe they were due to big hits. We didn't have any, which is interesting. But it's not like 05. The other thing I wanted to see was pancakes. The most they had was one guy had four. And I'm thinking jump the snap... You know, the, the opposite effect is the offensive line doing damage on the defensive line. But, and we only had one. So I'm okay with that. That's not that big of a deal for me. And they ran the ball quite a bit, so I'm not too worried about that. Defensively, I don't know what I was going to look for here. Uh, pass deflections. Was it pass deflections? They only had two. We had two. That seems really normal. I don't... Okay. Overall, I am beyond pleased. Leaderboard. I don't know what all that is. I'll have to look into that later. We got user stats. That's a new addition. Uh, okay. Hopefully you enjoyed all that. I know, again, this was a bit of a surprise. I wanted to give 09 some more, a bit of a chance. I got a little worried after I figured out the probation thing. But I'm going to try to look past it some because of what I mentioned a few times already. All right, come on back. I don't know if I, I'll... I'm either going to play my 06 game, my next one against A&M, or we might go into another exhibition game with 09. Leave your thoughts and comments on all of this stuff and what you think about 09. And I'm super excited. Again, they took out some of the goofiness. Even though the momentum meter and big hits are still in there, we didn't see any goofiness on the fumble stuff because the 07 games, every single game I played and recorded and put up on the channel, every game had a minimum of two fumbles. This one only had one, and technically that shouldn't have even happened because that was just a bad play on my part. So that is a very positive sign. All right, come on back. I'll figure out what to do next, and I'll talk to you guys later.